Ooh, I hope y'all brought y'all shades. For the Summer Glow makeup tutorial, watch me transform. Hey, Beat and Bombay's Grenade Mar here. Thanks for tuning in. Boo gal. Today I'm doing this quick, natural, summer glowy look. That's perfect for the summer. I'm talking basic to baddie. Boom. If you're new here, thanks for watching. Tune in weekly every Friday and Sunday for more content. It's time to drop the beat and bomb out this face. I'm going to start with a primed moisturized face. I'm using MAC Studio Fix NC42. I absolutely swear by MAC Studio Fix. It fills in my fine lines and it gives my skin that smooth blur with a light layer. I did my brows and my eyeshadow base already. So with a fluffy blending brush, use the Studio Fix on your lids. Avoid the brow bones. This is the ColourPop Double On Tendre Shadow Palette. I'll be using Locked and Loaded. I'm applying it all over my lid as a base for my natural eyeshadow. Moving on to Keep It PG in the same palette. Yeah, that's the name of the color. I'm going to put this glittery color on my lid. I'm applying Locked and Loaded on my outer V to shape the ombre eyeshadow effect. ColourPop palettes are always so pigmented. This is my first impression of the e.l.f. cream liner. It's a gel. I really didn't care for it. It's not as dark as I like with flashes on. But I'ma still serve sis. We are moving on to the Bare Minerals Bare Pro Foundation and BH Cosmetics Studio Pro Beauty Blender. You want to make sure she is damp. My first impressions of the Bare Minerals Bare Pro Foundation was featured in my foundation haul video. Be looking out for that. It's going to be on my channel soon. Fenty Beauty's Pro Filter as my highlighting concealer. We are highlighting under the eyes, the chin, the cupid's bow, the nose, and the forehead. I actually didn't care for the Fenty Beauty concealer at first. It was a little too cakey for me. But now that I blur my skin underneath, it just gives that smooth buttery finish and I absolutely love it. Use the buffing brush to blend for a flawless finish. My brush is from Reels Technique. I'll be using a soft contour from Smashbox Studio Skin Foundation Stick to contour my shadows. I absolutely love this stick. Contour your cheek hollows, your nose, along your hairline, and your chin. I'm buffing the product in. We all seen those oval brush sets and question what they were used for. Well, I'm using this oval face blender brush to shape my nose. <laughs> Tarte's Pro Glow and Blush. Girl, here's where the bomb glow comes in. I'm using the color B to add blush along 
my cheekbones. I'm setting with Huda Beauty's loose powder. Let it sink into your skin for a few minutes. Dust the product away. I'm highlighting with High Five from the Tarte Pro Glow and Blush Palette. I'm highlighting on and slightly above my blush, my brow bone, nose, my cupid's bow, and my forehead lightly. Scandinavia setting spray to set my skin. Finally, the lips. Max Chestnut and LA Girl in the color Natural. I'm lining my lips with chestnut and filling it in with natural by LA Girl. Buxom is about to juice things up with their plumping lip cream. Watch, I'm using hot toddy all over my lips. Hair Store Lashes by Kiss. I reuse mine. I'm cleaning the old glue off. <laughs> there you have it, babes. A natural summer glow makeup tutorial. I went from defeated to beat it, from boom to bomb, and you can too. Thanks for tuning in to another bomb tutorial. Subscribe for weekly videos every Friday and Sunday. Twice a week just isn't enough, huh? I'll also be doing bomb beauty tips on my social media at grenade underscore mar. Boom that like button in, bomb that subscribe button, and don't forget to share. May your day be as bomb as you are. We see you girl, and I'll see you next video.